I'm sorry, but it's wrong. And you know whose fault it is? Mitch and Murray. Ah, the hell with him. Let's get some lunch, huh, Rick? Leeds won't be up here till later anyway. So. You're a client. I just sold you five waterfront Glengarry Farms. I do this with my hair. I throw me to cute Kenilworth. Which is it? Kenilworth. I mean, I own the property. My mother owns the property. I put her into it. You look on the plots, you go home. Uh, you'll see. A3 through 10. 26 to 30. I mean, take your time. If you still feel you don't want to... Oh, hey, I won't need more time, Rick. I bought a lot of property. I've got to talk to you. Jim, what are you doing here? Jim Link, uh, D. Ray Morton. I'm glad to meet you. I just put Jim into Black Creek. Are you acquainted with... Uh... Black Creek, no. Uh, oh, in Florida. Yes. I'd <clears throat> like to speak to you about that. Well, we'll do that this week. My wife suggested I look into it. Yes, beautiful, beautiful rolling land. I was telling Jim and Ginny, Ray, I gotta tell you something. Ray, you, you eat in a lot of restaurants, Ray, I know you do. Ray is with American Express. Can I tell Jim what you do? Sure. Ray is director of all European sales and services for America. What I'm saying is you haven't had a meal until you tasted it. I was at the Lynx. <laughs> what was that service feature you were talking about? You wish home cooking. What did uh, you had a you had a tag phrase that you used? Cooking. Home co uh, uh, the monthly interview. The magazine. Yes. Oh. Well, I... is that something <laughs> I can talk about? Well, it won't be out until the February issue, but I'll go ahead. Are you sure? Go ahead. Anyway, Ray was eating one of his company men's homes in France, right? The man is French. Hey, you know, but his wife is. Ah, oh, his wife. <laughs> Ray, what time do you have? Twelve fifteen. I gotta get you on a plane. Oh, didn't I say the two? No, the one o'clock. Remember you said the one o'clock. That's why we couldn't talk to Kenilworth. Oh, you're right. The one. Let's scoot. A pleasure. Yeah. Uh, I gotta talk to you. I gotta run right to the airport. Come on, let's hustle. John, get on the phone to Pittsburgh, American Express there, for Mr. Morton. Will you tell him he's on the one o'clock? I'll see you. Oh, Christ. I'm sorry you came all the way in. I'm running right to the airport. You wait here and I'll... No, I can't. I'm meeting your man at the back. I wish you'd have phoned. What? All right, wait. Are you and Ginny going to be home tonight? I don't know. We... Rick, what? Uh, Kenilworth. I'm sorry. Kenilworth. Oh, God. I'm, I, excuse me, Ray, just a minute. Uh, Jim, I told you who he is. is the senior vice president of American Express. His family owns 32. Over the past years, I have sold him, I can't tell you the dollar amount, but quite a lot of land. I promised him five weeks ago that I would go to the wife's birthday party in Kenilworth tonight. I have to go. You understand? I mean, it's something I have to. They treat me like a member of the family. I have to go. It's funny, you know, you get a picture of the corporation type company man, all business. This guy, I have to tell you. We'll go to his house someday. Let me see. Tomorrow. I'm in LA. Uh, Monday. I'll take you to lunch. What would you like to eat? My wife's. Hey, Ray. I can't talk now, Jim. I'll call you tonight, all right? Sorry. I'm coming, Ray. My wife said I have to cancel a deal. It's a common reaction, Jim. And let me tell you what it is, and I know that that's why you married her. One of the reasons is prudence. No, it's a sizable investment. One thinks twice. It's also something women have. Reaction to the size of the investment. Monday, you invite me to dinner again. I mean, this woman can cook. Oh, I'm sure she can. We're going to talk because I'm... I want to tell you something. Something about your acreage, I want you to know. I can't talk about it here, and I really shouldn't. And by law, I can't. The man next to you bought his lot at 42, he phoned to say he already had an offer. Rick. I'm coming, Ray. What a day. I'll call you this evening. Jim, I'm sorry I had to come all the way in. I'm sorry. Monday lunch. We really have to go. All right, Monday. She called the consumer, the, the, the attorney, um, I don't know, the attorney general. They said we have three days. Who'd she call? The attorney, uh, it was some consumer office. Why'd she do that, Jim? I don't know. I don't know, but they said we have three days. They said we got three days, yeah. Three days? To, you know. No, I don't know. Tell me. What well, to change our minds. Of course you have. Three days. Well, so we can't talk Monday. Monday, you saw my book. Jim, Jim, I can't. You saw my book. I can't. Yeah, but we have to before Monday to get our money back. Three business.